Recently I showed you how to revert from using the Google Assistant to using the older Google Now on tap. Whenever you long press on that home button. Another popular request that I get is how to change the long press of the home button shortcut back to just a simple web search. So that's what I want to show you how to do today. As you can as you just saw whenever you I long press on the home button it's wanting to activate Google Assistant because that's what I have set to right now. Now to change that to a web search you can do you can download one of two applications. As you can see here, I have the Firefox application installed, as well as the Search Bar EX, which is a widget. Now you know Firefox is a web browser, so launching it will just open a web browser. This icon actually just opens up a Google search widget at the very top of the screen. So to change that long press trigger you just need to go into the settings application then you're gonna to want to scroll down a bit and tap on the apps option and depending on which phone you have that apps or it could be labeled applications could be hidden but it should just be in the main settings page and on supported devices you're gonna have this gear icon at the top right you're just gonna to want to tap on that gear icon and this is gonna let you change the default applications for a number of different things like the home screen or your default browser or your phone or your SMS app but you should also have an assistant and voice input option here. We're just going to go ahead and tap that. We have some toggles here that we can switch, but as you can see, it's currently set to the Google app, which is why Google Assistant pops up. So we want to change that, so we're going to tap on the Assist app option. Now depending on which applications you have installed and which support this assist app, like you could install Microsoft's Cortana and that would be listed there. But since I have Firefox and Search Bar EX there, those are listed as well as the Google app. So since I just showed you that Search Bar EX, we're just going to change that. This tells us that the assistant will be able to read information about apps in use on your system. So just be sure that you trust the application that you set as your assistant. And tap on that agree button. Now we can tap the home button to go back to the home screen. And to test that we're just going to long press on that home button. And now we instantly get our search bar just as if we tapped on that icon. We can do our search testing here. And that will be just as if you did a search in Google. Since Chrome's default search engine is currently set to Google. Now to, just to show you how it looks whenever we do it with Firefox. Again, we're just going to go through the same uh, steps we did before. This time we're going to select Firefox. Firefox is a more trustworthy application in a lot of people's eyes. Tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. Now, whenever we long press, we get that search box again. As you can see, it says search with Yahoo. And that's because we have Yahoo set as the default search engine for Firefox. Of course, if you open up Firefox, go into it and change the default search engine, we could change it to Google and that would say search with Google.
So as you can see, it's just a quicker way of accessing a web search by using one of these two applications as the default assistant on Android. This will work on a number of different devices. Right here I have the Pixel device, but it will work on other devices as long as those let you change the default assistant. That feature is baked into the Android operating system, so unless the manufacturer of your phone has specifically removed that option, then it will be available. You just need to search for where it is and again it's usually located in the apps section it could be a gear icon it could be a three dot menu and an advanced section you just need to go to where you can change the default applications for things like the home screen the browser etc